Hello and welcome to Burbridge High School's PE department. My name is Mr Field and I'm going to be taking for you a few points today in concern to what you can expect from PE here at Burbridge High School. So, first of all, uh, the statement that we as a department try to abide by is that we, we endeavour to provide all pupils with a broad and balanced PE curriculum that will help foster a positive physical activity habits that will last a lifetime. What we mean by this is obviously that we try to give everybody the opportunity to take part in a wide range of sports and activities to help them achieve a good, healthy lifestyle. Now, with the curriculum design that we have here at Borough Bridge, it does allow pupils to study a wide range of traditional and emerging sports as part of your PE lessons. So there's over 20 different sports and activities that you'll be studying over your five years of your time at Burbridge High School. So lots of activities that will hopefully be appealing to a wide majority of you. In concern to Key Stage 3, so for years 7, 8 and 9, the, the things that we tend to focus on within these year groups are, first of all, the performance, decision making and evaluating of performance, and the physical and social development. So obviously it's really important that we, we teach you a lot about the different sports and different activities that we'll be covering. But a lot of it also is not just about the physical aspect of can you physically do this, but we're actually wanting to develop the mental aspect too. So can you actually think about what you're doing as a sports person during an activity? That's the kind of real uh, challenge that we, we put pupils way. Now during years seven, eight and nine, you will be covering two hours of PE a week which obviously covers all these various activities uh, as mentioned previously. So lots of opportunities to take place in lots of different activities. Now as you move through the school into years 10 and 11, into Key Stage 4, then during these lessons then we will be looking to offer a, a greater diverse range of activities. Uh, as you've worked through Key Stage 3, we will have covered a lot of activities. And by the time we get to Key Stage 4, we'll be looking to... Uh, develop opportunities for sports uh, yeah, you, that you're confident in but also to try new activities that you might not have heard of before so that when you do leave us then you've got a wide range of activities that you've accessed and you know how to take part in so you can look to maintain a, a long healthy lifestyle long after you've left us at Burbage High School. Now the lessons in year 10 and 11 you have one hour a week of PE in year 10 and 11. But there still will be plenty of opportunities for you to take part in sports and activities outside of lesson times. Now, in concern to the key stage four, in years 10 and 11, for those people who are really keen to learn more about the subject area, there is the opportunity to study GCSE PE. Uh, now, that is with the exam board at Excel. And what that will involve is five lessons of GCSE PE in a week. Now, these GCSE PE lessons are additional to your core PE as well, so you will not be sacrificing any of your PE time to study GCCP. It is an additional uh, lesson that will be put forward for you. So, in concern to GCCP, you will be assessed on your practical ability. That will make up 40% of the mark that you will get. And your theoretical knowledge, which we will cover in classroom-based lessons, and that will cover 60% of the content. Now, Burbridge pupils consistently achieve above the national average in this subject, so it is a very good subject if you are interested in sport, and we do achieve some really, really good GC grades within this qualification. Now, the facilities. We're very, very lucky with the facilities and the equipment that we have at Burbridge High School. Really, really well stocked with the equipment, with a, a real wide range of sporting uh, uh, equipment that we have available for us to use. We have the largest sports hall in the area, which is equipped for a wide range of sporting activities, including basketball, trampolining, corfball, volleyball, five cricket nets and six badminton courts, to list just a few. We also look at have a dance studio, outdoor netball courts, outdoor basketball rings, a five-a-side astro turf pitch, three football pitches, which can accommodate varying age groups, and in the summertime, we have a 400 meters athletics track marked out on the field, but also we have a fantastic separate large long jump pit area. Uh, 
We also have the school grounds mapped out for orienteering and a host of other exciting sports and equipment that you'll be looking to use over your time with us at Boroughbridge High School. Now it's not just about the lesson time. I feel that PE in itself is more about what you do outside of school as much as what you do during the lesson time. So with that in mind, we looked to offer that little bit extra. And what we mean by this is offering a wide range of lunchtime and after school activity clubs that will be offered throughout the year. These will tend to reflect the activities that will be studying at those periods of time. So if you do have an interest in a sporting activity, then there's a chance to further develop that, uh, that ability and that interest in the extracurricular clubs that we'll be looking to put, put on. We will take part in as many fixtures against local and regional schools in a wide range of sports as often as we possibly can. We are in constant contact with other uh, PE departments across the, the network of schools to try and arrange as many fixtures as we possibly can. Uh, the sports day is a whole school involvement. Uh, we look to get as many pupils from each and every form involved in this as possible. So that is a full day event where we're looking to cover all track and field events within athletics. And again, just trying to have a little bit of fun with it and trying to make sure that everyone's having that sense of achievement. Uh, in Key Stage 4, there is the opportunity to take up Duke of Edinburgh. This is currently being developed and further details will be announced in the coming few months in concern to the offer that we can put forward for Duke of Edinburgh. Now, outside of the normal fixtures and the extracurricular after-school clubs, we're also looking to be putting on other kind of sporting activity trips too. One of these has been successfully run for a many number of years now and that is a Beulah Park residential trip. This tends to happen in year nine and will involve you taking part in lots of outdoor education activities, things like gorge walking, mountain biking, climbing, uh, lots and lots of fun adventurous stuff to be doing there. Also taking people to escape, learning how to ski and snowboard and also trips to Leeds Urban Bike Park to develop your biking ability on the purpose built trails at that fantastic local facility. Now this is just uh, a few of the activities that will be put, put on obviously as, uh, as things develop over the years we'll be looking to try and add more exciting uh, additional activities to that long list. So I hope that you uh, have enjoyed that little explanation there. If you do have any questions please, please feel free to contact the school and I'll be happy to discuss them further. Thank you very much for your time.